Such a beautiful view. Mmm, <laughs> 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 I told you you were like a couple of months ago because you didn't know if you were going to happen here. <laughs> There's any centaur. It's uh, really beautiful up here, but really windy. Um, Ninja has been having some pain, so we'll see what happens. Keep him going for now. So it's my 1.37 ish. I just left Snapper and Ninja at 6.30 p.m. Then almost completely wiped out, hurt my knee, haha. <laughs> um, anyways, <clears throat> gonna hike a few more miles because I need to get to Paradise Valley Cafe in the morning and it's a big, big, long climb. And they close at three and I need my package. So I gotta go. So I had to say my sad little goodbye. Hopefully I see them in a couple days in Idlewild. And onwards I go. Probably my first night hike of the trip. So, woohoo! Here we go. Look how spiky you guys are, my dudes. Why do you need to be that spiky, huh? Why do you need to be that spiky? I don't want to get you. Please don't get me. Spiky dudes. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Whoa, baby, you might be one of the tallest I've seen so far. Go you. Hello, little ants. You going somewhere? Look at teamwork. Go, guys, go. Cool. This is like a really, really beautiful time of night to be hiking. So gorgeous. This twilightish hour, there's the moon, there's my face. So cute! Seven, it's like 7.30 almost. All right, should I go for some lizard water, guys? Lizard water? Can you see the dead lizard in there? I don't even see him. Maybe so I have about a liter and a half left and there's water, I hope, in about 5.8 miles in the morning. So that's overnight though. Um, I don't really wanna dig down in there because there's no one here and if it collapses, which it looks like it could, um, I'd be swimming in there all night. So I guess I'm uh, going with my liter and a half. I just started to freak myself out pretty good because um, it's my first time hiking at night. And also, almost time for a headlamp. Um, and also just got super like creeped out about mountain lions. It's my first time out here alone at night. And then I saw people down there and all my worries just went away. And I'm like, oh my gosh, it's so funny how quickly you can um, rile yourself up out here. <laughs> Oh, 
So, it's about 8 o'clock now. I've been climbing straight up out of this canyon. Nothing you can see. There's a huge canyon behind me for uh, the last 15 minutes or so. There's a campsite in about a mile and a half, about 500 more feet up, um, which is probably where I'm gonna end my night. So let's see. This is really cool. Big rock, another rock, and down there, the canyon. Not that you can see it. Woohoo! All right. So I continue. All right, here we go. Pretty cool. These rocks are super cool. They're huge. Oh, got stuff on a cactus. Whew. So many cactuses on the edge of the trail. Watch out for them. Ooh, hello. You can't see the moon and stars because I have the flash on. Ha <laughs> ha. Found a place to camp. I'm gonna cowboy. It's um almost nine o'clock. Good night.